Well, hello there everyone, and uh, welcome to what I would like to call my first mistake of 2017. <laughs> Hopefully it won't be like that. Like my grandma used to say, think wrong and you'll be right. That, that's, that's our mantra. First of all, an introduction to those who doesn't know who, who the hell I am. My name is Mauricio, and if you're wondering, why are you so shiny? Well, I'm right now at almost 35 degrees. Sorry for the reflection of my greasy skin. Wow. Why am I doing this? Why I was saying that probably it's gonna be a mistake? Well, let me tell you. The concept of the thing that puts everything together on this channel is that I'm planning to be very honest, to actually say the things that I have in my head. It's gonna be basically like a video diary of this 2017 new opportunities and all that bullshit. First things first, probably two years before finishing high school, I've been dealing with a lot of anxiety, an anxiety that lead to stress, panic attacks, depressions, and it made me feel very insecure about myself. Managed to just go outside and smile even when I didn't feel like it. It's been years of training, years. And something that I learned during those years is that many people feel the same way. Many people are dealing with anxiety, depression, low self-esteem, panic attacks, and I wanna make this clear from now on. I'm not an expert, I'm not a doctor, I'm not a psychologist, I'm just a regular guy going through this who has discovered how things are based on experiences. The first uh, years of this I was very embarrassed because it was very young and I was just thinking this is not an attitude for a young guy to have, not in an emo way or anything. I don't know, I think that I overthink everything I do and that that takes away a lot of my time. But again, I keep ramble too much and I do that, sorry. I have no script or anything, I just sat down and decided to talk. Basically what I want to do with this channel, use it as some kind of video diary of my plans or the way I want to face this whole anxiety thing. So basically it's like a diary of how I'm gonna deal with this. Because I'm not cured of it, and I don't think I'm ever gonna be cured, but I think I can find ways to actually face it and make it work. Because anxiety has been taking me through many bad decisions, not bad decisions like I'm doing bad things, bad decisions of the way that I react. I find myself like running away from the world sometimes. I'm always in the defensive mode, like I turn sometimes into this kind of little monster. Not like the Lady Gaga little monster thing, just... Wow, that came out wrong. Not a little... Wow. Basically what I'm trying to say is that it turned me into this kind of person that is always at the defensive, very sarcastic sometimes, or repressive with my feelings, but sometimes I just let it go. I don't know, I can't control very well, I don't know what I'm doing sometimes. I understand that many people out there feel the same, or even if you don't feel like that, probably you know someone, especially in these modern times when everyone's letting their feelings be read by everyone on social media or whatever. Like me. Hmm. But for those who have it, for those who know someone, for those who wants to be on top of whatever is going on in other people's mind, I found the, the idea of this channel very helpful. Not only for you, but also for me. I want to see this as some kind of therapy, because to be honest with you right away, doing this, it's an incredible challenge for me. Being in front of the camera plenty of times, I even have another YouTube channel with a friend from Canada. My first language is Spanish, that's why I have the accent. Why am I speaking English? I don't know, it just came out like that, <laughs> I couldn't stop. I guess after three years abroad, my brain just got reset or something weird. And also to practice, I do want to practice. Being in front of the camera has been very tough for me. My insecurities, my anxiety, and my low souls as it made me look at myself like deformed, almost like I couldn't even think of the idea of editing my face. If you're watching this, it's because I finally put my shit together and I decided to go for it, which is a big step for me. Actually, I've been trying to make this video like at least five times before the, the year was over. But finally, January 1st, I found it like uh, my year resolution to actually do it. And I hope it works. My main objective with this is to be honest, to let people know how this feel so they can see that I'm not a bad person, I'm just a person in conflict. I want this to turn into a us thing, not just me. So I want the comments to be active if you want to tell me what you're going through, if you want to just say it and other viewer can just jump in it and make you feel better. I know it's internet, I'm just putting myself in front of the, the cannon just waiting for all the awful comments and uh, trolls and everything. But I think it's part of this therapy to actually face it and moving forward and understand that no, I'm not deformed. 
I don't know why, when I go outside I feel like I'm having one of those awful filters for photo booth and you know, just twist my face or something. Also to face that I, my anxieties can be controlled, my depression can be solved, my panic attacks can be actually faced and I can move forward. I can find help, like I've been with psychologists, psychiatrists, all the um, shenanigans. I'm not against that and I actually would like to go back. But then I thought there's so much people out there that feel lonely because I have, I feel very lonely with this. I said to myself if I'm gonna do it, why not to do this together? Maybe I, I can't do it by myself and maybe I'm gonna stop doing this if I find myself very down one day but if you guys are there and tell me constantly just keep doing it, I like your videos, come on, blah blah blah. I'm not forcing you to say you like my videos, God! To feel like someone's there, somebody needs it or that someone is actually listening to me and understanding that I'm not just insane, I'm just in a specific mindset that I'm trying to fix or arrange. So, I don't want to make it look like a depressing channel or something to, oh my God, <laughs> he's sad. Within the sound of silence no, I don't want people to think that I'm sad, and I want to make this clear, I'm not an expert of any kind, I'm not a psychiatrist, I'm not a psychologist, if one day I just go out and I don't feel like it, I'm probably not gonna end up every video with, this is what you can do to feel better, there's always a hope, because probably I'm not gonna be feeling that way, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm just gonna go straight forward, because I wanna know if there's someone out there that feels the same, and by helping me, you might be helping uh, so many people out there. That's me just thinking that a lot of people is gonna reach to this video. We don't know. We prob probably gonna be just family that doesn't understand because they only speak Spanish, they don't understand English. And just some friends from Canada is gonna be like, look at this guy, what the hell? He has glasses now? Yeah, astigmatism this side. Anyways, some videos probably is gonna have more funny things on it. They're gonna be more happy in some way. And other videos might be more serious. Maybe story times or whatever, I don't know. Like real life, sometimes we have ups and downs. And this that's what that channel is gonna be be like. This is honestly a way also to escape and distract me because the situation in the country it's killing all my creativity and I always been a very creative guy and I don't feel that's right that I'm just going through this pain killing my creativity just for the hell of it. I'm not gonna let this awful government, awful situation that we're facing to defeat me and turn me into a zombie that can't leave his room. I've never been like that and I'm not gonna start now. I don't know if I'm gonna help you solve the problems, but I think we can do it together and you can help me. So, if you wanna support, just remember to share this video, give it a like, give it a bunch of those, they're free, they don't do anything bad. If you wanna help, just remember to subscribe to this channel, because I'm using my hands too much. I'm just like, can I keep my hands here? Please subscribe because that would be amazing. And yeah, share it, like it, show it to people because you don't know who feels like this. You don't know who actually needs this. I hope you guys can help me and hopefully I can help you. I don't know. It's nice to see you all again. And I hope 2017 it's a year of just facing the demons and actually defeat them. So, thank you very much. I'm Mauricio, Mauricio Blanco, full name. Remember all my social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all of that is gonna be right there in the description. That's it, that's it for tonight. And I hope you have a wonderful year, a healthy year with your family, friends, all the best. That's it, bye. <laughs>